Hey guys, I'm back. I no longer want to die. I've recovered my will to live. And we are headed to the Castle of Dreams. Let's go. Is something wrong? It's just that my friends made me the most beautiful dress. But my I hate it when that happens. Oh, never mind. It, and I was so looking forward to the ball. <laughs> Darkness always finds a way into a wounded heart. You have to be strong. Strength of heart. Yeah, quit your whining. Are you through the heart bitch. Of the Unversed. Yes. Terra apparently has no empathy whatsoever. Also, I know I commented on this during uh, Ventus's playthrough, but Terra's pants though. But Terra's pants though. Name a more iconic duo. Then Terra and his massive pants. Alright, is that everything? Nope, it is not. You know, I think we actually got a new slot for a new uh, move to equip. Maybe we should do that soon. No, don't drink the potion, dang it. We gotta get potions out of our list here. Speed this guy up, there we go. Why is potions still in my command deck? Also, why am I losing? Here, let's uh do one of these. We really need a cure spell. A more permanent way of healing. Ow! Oh, we are in trouble. Let's uh let's summon Aqua. Wow, that was that was quite a combo. Let's uh, let's cure. Thunder. Gather. There we go. Easy. We definitely didn't almost die like a billion times. Thank you. Somebody with some empathy. Nothing. Nothing, my dear. Oh, no. You don't really mean that. Oh, but I do. It's just no use. Nonsense. If you'd lost all your faith, I couldn't be here. And here I am. Oh, come now. Dry those tears. You can't go to the ball looking like that. The ball? Oh, but I'm not. Of course you are. But we'll have to hurry. Now, what were those magic words? Oh, yes. This can't last forever. You'll have only till midnight, and then on the stroke of twelve, the spell will be broken, and everything will be as it was before. 
Yes, I understand. was full of light. Why didn't I see it? What did you do? I can hardly tell she's the same person. Who are you? Tara. Tara, in your heart, do you believe that dreams can come true? I do. But I also believe you have to make an effort to make them come true. Yes, of course. But sometimes just believing in dreams is easier said than done. Cinderella believes her dreams can come true. I wanted her to see that she is right. So that's what made her shine. Faith in her heart that anything is possible. Where did she go? To the royal ball at the palace. Go, and when you see her dancing, you'll know that she believes, and that will help you to believe too. All right, off to the ball. This is a whole new area of this world that we never saw in Ventus's playthrough. Yes, level up. Strength and defense increase. Sick. About time. After that last boss, I need about as many level ups as I can get to make sure that doesn't happen again. Oh yeah, we were going to equip a new command in our command deck. First of all, no more potions. Uh... Blizzard. And, uh, I don't know. Slow? Sure, why not? Oh, you know what? We might have a new Keyblade to equip, too. Hold on. Hold on. What do we got? Better magic, worse strength. Eh, sure. We'll, we'll do it for now. We will switch back if necessary. There we go. Already making gains toward the next level. That's what I like to see as I mash X at these fools. Alright, so that's what slow does. Oh, great. This guy has like a long period of invulnerability because slow forces him to stay in his... that thing longer. Alright. <clears throat> Noted, don't use slow on those guys. Pulsing Crystal. What do we got over here? Anything? Nothing? Haha. -ha. We got this thing. Which I believe is probably a map. And I'm right. Alright, let's up. Okay, we can't use that save point until we beat these guys up. Works for me. Like I said, we need as many enemies to kill as possible. Oh, Diamond Dust. We know Diamond Dust. Heck yeah. Alright. Let us save.
Take that! Uh, please do let me know if in future Kingdom Hearts episodes, like, probably not for Birth by Sleep just because I'm so far ahead of these recordings already, but in, uh, the other games, if I should cut out some of these fights just because they, I could see them getting boring to watch. But, I mean, if not, uh, I'd be happy to not cut them out, but, um, but if they are... Uh, I would I would be perfectly happy also to cut them out. I just I don't know what to do, so I'm not gonna cut them out till I get the feedback to do so. Not here too. Whoa whoa whoa! Why can't I do that move when I'm playing? I met you before. I'll take care of them. You wait right here. Please, may I go with you? I so want to get to the ball. Um. All right. But stay behind me, or you'll get hurt. <laughs> You're not worried? Didn't you tell me it was important to stay strong? Oh. Um, I, I guess I did. <laughs> <laughs> so, you ready? Yes. All right, protect Cinderella, get her into the ball. My question is why have we not called off the ball completely, considering that there are deadly monsters just kind of running around the ballroom, but whatever. All right, Cinderella. Oh, okay. Working on it. Slow is actually very helpful here. Keep them from attacking Cinderella for longer. Oh, 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 okay. Yep, we need to get over there now. Don't let this guy attack her. There we go. Okay, let's go. Get the green guy. No, get the green guy. Get the green guy. He's clearly the bigger threat. There we go. No, no, no. We're too far away. We're too far away. We're too far away. No, 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 no. She's taking massive damage. Get rid of this guy. There we go. All right. We did it, I think. Maybe. I think. What? Cinderella something? Oh, just talk to her. Uh-oh. I hope she doesn't keep that damage she took in the last room. She does. We are what you call screwed. Oh boy. Get nope, nope. Okay, yep, that yep, that's what was gonna happen. Uh okay. Yep, Cinderella got hit so hard that we died. I told you guys Tara was the hardest. Oh, what? It puts us back in this room. Okay. With a full gauge. So, let's just, uh, pull one of these, I guess. Seems kind of like cheating, if I'm being honest, but whatever. I pressed the wrong button. Of course I pressed the wrong button. Why didn't I just press... Oh. Ow. I guess I should just start considering the idea that maybe I just suck at this game. Maybe that's why everything's going poorly. Maybe it's not because I'm playing Terra, or because I'm underleveled in some way. Maybe I just suck at this game really bad. I would say that's a distinct possibility. Whoa there, Cinderella, you're getting away from me. Hold on. Hold on, Cinderella. Well, strength increase, that's good, right? Uh, 
Alright, let's go. Up we go, Cinderella. No? Hello? There we go. Okay. Information. Cinderella hasn't caught up. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. Make it stop. There we go. Slow, slow. Ah, some bad things are happening all of a sudden. Okay, uh, cast it slow. Use this. Perfect. Okay, I think we did it. Nope, we did not yet did it. Uh, go other one, other one, other one, other one. What are you doing, Terra? I was trying to target the other guy. The stupid targeting system is kind of garbage. Okay, retry again. Then I'm starting to be reminded of the last boss. Ah, uh, that's not O. I pressed O instead of square on accident. Wait, Cinderella took a shit ton of damage while I was. Oh, okay, this is just. This is already doomed. Go, Cinderella, go! We don't got time! We don't got time! Go, 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 go! We're slow. We need more slow. Slow! And of course they interrupted it. Wonderful. Stop, Cinderella, stop! What are you doing? Why would you target that guy when I'm clearly trying to target this guy? No, not that guy. This guy. There we go. Oh boy. Yeah, you guys stay down there. We don't. We don't have time for you. All right. Switch to slow. All these guys are slowed. Beat them up. Beat them up. Beat them up. Beat them up. Okay. Don't attack that guy. Attack. No, this guy. There we go. There we go. That'll do it, right? I think. Yeah. Finally. Oh, never mind. There's uh, something else going. What? Wait, what? Did we? Did we win? Okay, we did win. Cool. Counter hammer. Uh, using counter to strike back right after a successful block. After blocking, press the X button to strike. Okay. Yeah. Sorry about that, guys. That was. Me sucking. I suck. In case you don't know. Oh, thank you, um... Tara. Thank you, Tara. This is either an awkwardly silent cutscene, or I just can't hear the sound because it's too low on my TV. Maybe just believing is enough. As long as you have a magic fairy godmother to grant all your wishes, believing is indeed enough. Who is she, Imagine that. familiar about her. <laughs> Unversed. <laughs> Tell me, how do I get up there? <clears throat> well, uh, there is a passage beneath the foyer staircase. Thanks. All right, I guess, beneath the foyer staircase we go. Ooh, look what else is beneath the foyer staircase. Is this the right way to go? I think so. 
Oh yeah, we have to equip counter hammer. Hold on. You beat up these little little guys first. Okay. Counter hammer time. Uh command X action commands. Counter hammer. Alright, cool. Well, I'll try that out. Get out of there! Oh boy. Actually, let me, let me wait for this guy to attack and then I'll I'll do a block into a counter hammer. Oh cool! Okay. It's awesome. It's actually very helpful. If we can bait these dudes into attack, you can just insta kill them. That's way faster. Probably good against bosses too, huh? Is there a cure spell here? Because I could go for one. There we go. Cure. I'd like one of those, please. Alright, let's throw that in the command deck. That should make things a lot easier from here on out. I've got to admit, this was not what I was expecting to see when I walked into this room. Down here. Guards? Guards? Oh, where could they possibly be? I'll take care of this. Defeat the Unverse. You can destroy its instruments. Okay, you can destroy its instruments. Let's try that. Break the drums! Beat up the drums. Kill the drums! Huh. Well, this hasn't been too bad so far. Can't say this has been super hard so far. What happens when you break the drums? Uh, as far as I can tell, nothing happened. Let's break the, this thing. The I am musically challenged. Is this a trumpet? I think it's a trumpet. Let's break the trumpet. Or whatever this is. I've got to say, I'm not super uh, intimidated by this guy so far. He seems to just be letting me beat up his instruments. Let's uh beat up the violin. I'm gonna assume that something is going wrong with this fight, like, like, on an AI level, because this is definitely not how this fight is supposed to go down. But whatever, all his instruments are dead, now it's doing something. Ow. Seems a little uncalled for, my dude. I can't say I'm particularly intimidated by this guy. I I'm pretty sure that it was, it was supposed to be a lot harder to break his instruments. Because I actually specifically remember on Critical Mode having trouble with this guy. Like, a lot of trouble. But, I mean, I don't want to speak too soon, but it doesn't seem like that's going to be the case this time. He's done, like, no damage. I 
I'm gonna just mash him to death. This is like the least interesting boss fight of all time. I, I guarantee you something went wrong on an AI level. There is no reason why this guy should be this easy. Especially because I specifically looking back on it remember this guy being difficult. But uh, I'm not complaining. Because I think they're just gonna hand us the win here. Okay. Sure. I mean, it's a little anticlimactic, but uh, it's better than failing a billion times like the last guy. Thank you. You saved us all. <sighs> the guests were just starting to enjoy themselves. Well, don't give up just yet. Oh! Tell me something. Have you always had a problem around here with those monsters? No. I believe uh, they began to appear shortly after a boy in a mask arrived in our kingdom. Those that saw him said the monsters obeyed his every command. A boy in a mask? Do you That'd know be Vanitas, I think. Well, um, no. I don't believe anyone has seen him since then. I see. Oh, my goodness. It's midnight. Yes, so it is. But why? Goodbye. Wait. Come back. Please come back. I'm sorry. Mademoiselle! Senorita! Wait! Well, hello there, Aqua. Tara! What are you doing here? Tara, Ven ran away from home. What? I think he left to go find you. Do you have any idea why? No. Actually, just before I left, he tried to tell me something. I should have listened to what he had to say. Oh. So, did you manage to locate Master Zaynort? No, but it seems he's looking for pure hearts filled with light. Pure hearts filled with light? All I can tell you is that his search hasn't taken him here. Alright. I'll stay and see if I can find more clues. Okay. The prince is in the ballroom ahead. He might have some answers. Thanks. Aqua, you still have the same dream? Well, yes. There's this girl here. Her name is Cinderella. She made me realize how powerful it is just to believe. No matter how impossible things seem. This is exactly the Kingdom Hearts corniness that I am here for. Will always be enough to light the darkness. Mm. If you see her, give her my thanks. Will do. The boy in the mask who is leading the unversed. Who is he? Does he have anything to do with Master Xehanort's disappearance? Alright, new Keyblade. Makes it easier to land critical hits. We'll give it a try. Let's open that menu. More critical hits, but worse magic. And we'll give it a shot. Why not? Alright, Dwarf Woodlands. It's the last of our first rotation of worlds. I mean, you guys have seen all the worlds by now. Uh, so you know kind of what to expect, kind of order-wise. Spirit of the mirror, come from the farthest space, through <coughs> wind and darkness. 
summon thee. Speak! Show me thy face. What wouldst thou know, my queen? Magic mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest one of all? <coughs> Famed is thy beauty, majesty. But hold, a lovely maid I see. Alas, she is more fair than thee. Alas for her. Reveal her name. Lips red as the rose, hair black as ebony, skin white as snow. Oh, snow white. A mirror that knows and sees everything. How about that? The heart of Snow White doth shine bright. Beware, my queen, a heart of light. Another one? Wait, what if Master Xehanort is here? <gasps> Who goes there? My name is Terra. I'm looking for a man named Xehanort. Master Xehanort. I thought maybe you might have seen him. That name is of no consequence to me. Wait. <laughs> well, bye. Ah, yes. I have a task for you. If you succeed, I will ask the mirror where you might find this Master Xehanort. And the mirror will know? Do you dare to question me? What is the task? <laughs> there is a young maid who resides in this castle. Her name is Snow White. Kill her. And to make you got sure it. you do not fail, bring back her heart in this. Her heart? I don't understand. You're after the Hearts of Light too? What I demand is her life. I've had more than enough of her light. What did this maiden do to you? That is no concern of yours. Now, heed my words. My radiance is all the light this kingdom needs. <laughs> Where can I find her? Outside the castle. There is a glade of wildflowers. You are dismissed. Go now and seek her there. A heart of light. This Snow White is my best chance right now. Maybe she will lead me closer to Master Xehanort. But what if I... No. I won't let that happen. What's up? Why are you still here? Go swiftly and bring me Snow White's heart. Okay. If I understand correctly, my mission is kill Snow White. I didn't remember this uh, part of the game being <laughs> quite so morbid, but... Okay then, off to go kill Snow White. Nothing fishy about that at all. Under orders from this super trustworthy looking woman, we're gonna go kill some random girl we never we never met or heard of before. This is morally fine. Don't question it. Yes, Diamond Dust! 
Seems like Diamond Dust is a good early one of these forms. Let's grab the map real quick. Oh, that's not the map. That's a mimic. Strength increase. That's exactly what I wanted. What's this? Well, well ain't that hit? Ain't that handy. Sorry, I hiccuped there. Okay, now the map, right? Nope, another mimic. We've got diamond dust, but no one to use it on. There we go. Die, 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 die. Get beat up with giant pieces of ice. There we go. Use the finisher. Beat this man up. Now, there's gotta be stuff down there, right? But that seems like the way to go. Eh, screw it, let's explore. Oh, that's where we came from. That bubbles are over there, right? The bubbles? Yeah, okay, so I know where we are. We just have this little corner to explore. Let's do a, uh, oops, a counter on this guy if I can avoid doing that on accident. What? Oh, he didn't die. What the heck? I'm supposed to die when I counter you. Hey, what the? Oh. There we go. Let's grab this chest. What's the point? Oh, can I, can I, do I have any fire spells? Oh, I have an extra spell slot. Didn't even notice. I don't have any fire spells though, unfortunately. But let's, uh, let's put, uh, sleep in the rotation. Why not? Maybe if I have a fire spell though, maybe I can light that and it does something good. That guy didn't really stand a chance, did he? Poor dude, I almost feel sorry for him. Alright. Ow. Let's spin this wheel. Uh, I'm gonna assume it did something good. Not sure where, though. I can't hear that well, but I think that the timer for how long that door is going to be down is up. I don't know where that door is, though. What's, uh, what's through here? Uh, I don't feel like we sufficiently explored this area. Sorry, I'm going to head down there one more time. Whoa, that was way faster than it was before. Did I level up my, uh, my move or something? Wait, that's... Okay, that's, that... The, uh, the lock-on was way faster than it used to be there. Aha! I think I see where that door is, but I do also see the timer in the upper left. It means I'm going to have to go press that wheel again. No, stop locking onto that. I'm trying to lock onto the wheel. What? 
thought this is where the... Alright. Oh, there it is. Alright. Now I gotta figure it out. Go to sleep. Oh, never mind. That didn't work. Yeah, that's way better. Way faster than it used to be. Let's open that on up. Hit this wheel, which I assume opens that. Yep, that's what I thought. And that's right over here. Better be something good at the end of all this. We have this, a block recipe. Uh, I'm not impressed. Gotta say, of all the things that could have been at the end of that maze of doors to open, I am not all that impressed by the block recipe. How do I get, there's a chest over there. How do I get that? I want that. Uh, whatever, we'll just leave. I'm confused. I've had enough of this place. I might need a power-up that I don't have yet, or an ability that I don't have yet, to, to get that treasure chest. Did I miss the map, by the way? We don't have a map yet. I don't think. Aha! Nope, that's not the map chest. Too small. I'm worried about that map. Eh. Well, found Snow White. Let's kill her. Do the deed, come on, kill her. Kill Snow White, that's our goal. Why are you just letting her live? Oh hello, who are you? Aren't you I'm your assassin. Should I be? It's true then. Her heart is pure light. She's the one. Is something the matter? Does the name Xehanort mean anything to you? Why, why no. I don't think I've ever heard that name. Now what? <laughs> I just want to point out that we just asked Snow White from Snow White in the Seven Dwarves don't go in there alone. <laughs> if the name Xehanort means anything to her. And I find that endlessly humorous. <laughs> like, Snow White. <laughs> From Snow White of the Seven Dwarves. Does the name Xehanort mean anything to you? These guys are not very scary, I have to say. As a, as a threat. I'm not particularly threatened. Frightened. These guys, however, might pose more of a threat. Too bad this move is extremely OP. Sheesh. I'm unstoppable. Oh, speaking of sleep. Sleep! Breathe. Want some? 
When I said speaking of sleep, that might have been confusing. My sleep spell leveled up right before I said that. But I could see that being confusing if you didn't notice that. Oh, yes! More of this! Beat him, beat all of them up with darkness or whatever the heck. Nice try. Ouch. Okay, okay. That was a significantly... Okay, okay, okay. That's enough of that. Go to sleep! Air slide. Oh, I can finally use my dash in midair. Thank... God. Lost her. She said she doesn't. Well, now how do we murder her? Lord. That leaves me with just one other option. The mirror. Back at the castle. What is this, Metroid? We're backtracking the entire way. Is this the map? This might be the map. I think it's the map. It's the map. Awesome. All right, backtracking through this entire area. Feel free to fast forward until we get to the mirror. Or stay and watch me beat all those enemies up again on my way back. I don't care, whatever you're into. While we're on our way back, another of my favorite facts about the Kingdom Hearts series, and just how ridiculous and stupid it is. I may have mentioned before that this game was originally on the PSP. That's the PlayStation Portable. For those of you who don't know what that stands for, I guess. Anyway, this game was originally on the PSP. Uh, the, two, the first two numbered titles, Kingdom Hearts 1 and Kingdom Hearts 2, were originally on the PS2. Chain of Memories was originally on the Game Boy Advance. Three of Eight Over Two Days and Coded were originally on the Nintendo DS. There is a mobile title. Dream Drop Distance was originally on the 3DS. And Kingdom Hearts 3 came out on the PS4. So, if you wanted to play all of these games on launch day, you needed to have a PS2, a PS4, a DS, 3DS, a PlayStation Portable, and a mobile device. Now, if that sounds like a whole heck of a lot of consoles, you are not wrong. <laughs> Only recently were all of these experiences kind of brought to the same, same system, that being the PS4. And even then, only to some degree. I mean, you can't play Union Cross on the PS4, not that you'd want to, it's, it's awful. And you can't play the DS games on the PS4, you can just watch all the cutscenes, which I'll be doing. Well, with you guys. But it's kind of ridiculous, and now that it's not an issue, like Melody of Memory, the next game that's coming out that I was talking about in the, in the series, the next game in the story. It's coming out on PS4, on Switch, and on Xbox. So, they're no longer kind of gatekeeping these entries, but now that I don't have to deal with it, since I became a Kingdom Hearts fan after all that shenanigans, I just get to take light and heart, and I get to kind of enjoy the fact that this series is so obtuse that not only does it have the gall to spread its lore and important story bits across basically all of these side games that come out on random consoles, but they actually come out on random consoles, as in, you actually can't experience the full game unless you own all of these consoles. It is just that ridiculous and obtuse and obnoxious and it's objectively bad. Like, bad, it's a bad way to tell a story, it's a bad business practice, like, it's, it's not good. 
But, since I don't have to deal with it, I just kind of find it hilarious, and I kind of love it. <laughs> like, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie. The fact that the, these games were originally spread across like a billion different consoles and mobile devices, I just find hilarious. How many consoles is that anyway? That's, uh, let's see. PSP is 1, PS2 is 2, DS is 3, 3DS is 4, GBA is 5. That's the Game Boy Advance. Mobile devices is 6, PS4 is 7. So that's 7 different consoles, if that's what you want to call them, that you had to own. Oh, and uh, 0.2, the other games that we're going to be playing that I didn't mention, also came out on PS4. So that's a total of 7 different consoles that you had to own if you wanted to play these games when they came out. How dare you return here, you blundering fool. What are you talking about? I ordered you to bring me Snow White's heart. A request I chose to ignore. You know, you claim to be radiant, but all I see are shadows of jealousy hanging thick. Boom roasted. You will pay for such insolence. Magic mirror on the wall. Consume this fool once and for all. <laughs> This is not some very, that is not very effective consumption. Do. Ah, here we go. I have no power save answers true. Huh? You dare defy your queen? <gasps> what? What, what exactly happened? Whatever, we're, we're fighting the magic mirror. All right, defeat the spirit of the magic mirror. I remember this boss fight. You gotta look for the face that looks like this. There's gonna be like a bunch of faces, and you gotta watch for the one that looks like this guy, so you can beat it up. I believe that's the gist of the fight. Up, 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 what? Oh, ow. Maybe not. Cause I'm failing. Yeah, here we go. Okay, so we gotta look for the one that looks like him. I'm not seeing it. Nope, that's not him. Oh, oh no. So I failed. It was that one. I don't remember how you tell him apart. Uh, okay, it's that one because he's smiling. Keep track of him and go in and hit him. Perfect. He doesn't have that much health, so he should be fine. This is not that hard, not gonna lie. Especially compared to that first boss, these other bosses have been just pieces of cake. Wow, that was easy. Why wasn't that guy the first boss? It wasn't that hard, I'm not gonna lie. Where can I find Master Xehanort? Magic mirror, instruct this knave. Give him the answers he doth crave. Beyond both light and dark he dwells, where war was.
was waged upon the fells. Is that all? Thanks. You've been a big help. Master Ericus said he first received word of these events from Master Yen Sid. Maybe it's time I went and spoke with him myself. Off to Master Disney backwards. And let's try out this new Keyblade. Why not? Keyblade! Give it to me! Strength up! But uh, I guess fewer critical hits and poorer reach are the trade-off for the extra strength. Sure, why not? I think these first three Keyblades are basically interchangeable in how good they are. Mysterious Tower. Let us land! Visit this world. Why, hello there. I think I recognize you. Also, why didn't we consul consult Master Disney backwards first, before visiting all those worlds? Eh, I guess don't question it would be the answer to that question. Huh. We can't go in the tower just yet. There's treasure chests to find. In the exact same place as they were in Ventus's playthrough, I think. I wonder if they have the exact same things in them that they had in Ventus's playthrough. I wouldn't be surprised. Ow. Ow. There we go. Put them all to sleep. Diamond dust these men to death, or whatever they are. These, what are they called again? Unversed. Sorry, there's just so many different types of enemies in Kingdom Hearts. I have to remember which ones I'm fighting. Ooh, another cure spell. Let's throw that in the command deck, and then we can merge them together to get a cure spell. And uh. Let's ditch sleep for fire, because there's some cool fire commands we can get later when we uh, merge fire with something else. Also, how is sleep not just objectively better than slow? I'm not sure. Maybe slow lasts longer? Or maybe sleep only lasts until you hit him? I'm not totally sure. Master Yen Sid. My name is Terra. Yes, Ericus's pupil. I've been expecting you. It is the unversed. Yes. Master Yen Sid. I thought it best to seek the counsel of one wiser than myself. I am no longer a master. I doffed that mantle. But sir, wasn't that your pupil I passed on the way in? 
He had a keyblade. You refer to Mickey. He too sought guidance here. As a king, he is good and kind. But the weight of a crown has not cured him of impetuousness. He has left with an object whose power he does not understand nor know how to control. Mickey imagines my star shard will be of help in his current quest. And like you, he is eager to use his keyblade to set things right. I'm not sure I even understand what's wrong. Master Xehanort is missing. And now I've learned there's a masked boy who is controlling those unversed on the loose. To arrive at the truth, perhaps you should approach things differently. First, consider them one and the same problem. Master Xehanort and the unversed are connected somehow? I must not make assumptions. Find Xehanort, Terra. That is where you should begin. Oh, that's what I was already doing. Yes, sir. Could you help me? Ask him for... Is that not what we were already doing? Could you help us a little bit out, Master Yen Sid? I yes, no? To Xehanort, your heart would no longer lead you astray. Well, you could have warned Terra that Master Xehanort's heart was leading him astray, too. Why'd you keep that information to yourself? This whole scene is just wrong. I don't like it. Whatever, I guess. Terra. <laughs> Master Xehanort. Terra. Come see me at once. Yeah, I would if I knew where you were. What, do I just suddenly know where he is now? I guess we just suddenly know where he is now. Okay, sure, why not? Not gonna question it, Kingdom Hearts. If there's one thing I've learned about Kingdom Hearts, it's just don't question it, just, just whatever. Sure, we know where he is now. Let us land and visit this world. Master Xehanort. I have been to other worlds. I know all about the things you've done. I just don't understand why. Someone had to safeguard the light from the demon I unleashed. You must know about the boy by now, the one in the mask. His name is Vanitas, a creature of pure darkness, one of my making. But don't worry, because I'm still super trustworthy. Are you telling me he came from you? He came from Ventus. Ventus? Yes. Ventus is the darkness that was inside your friend. It was an accident. While training with me, Ventus succumbed to darkness, and there was but one way to save him. Strip that part of him away, and thus Ventus was made. In the process, I damaged Ventus' heart in the most horrific way. So, I did what I felt was right and left him with Ericus. I knew the boy could not stay with me, the man who did him such grievous harm. Master Xehanort. Ventus has gotten a lot better since then. You shouldn't blame yourself for trying to save him. Well, thank you, lad. You know how to put an old man's heart at ease. So that's what it was.
Is he okay? I'll go see. I'm Tara. What's your name? Ventus. You can talk. Aqua, come here! <laughs> So, are you here to train with us? Where are you from? Who is that man with you? You good with a keyblade? <laughs> Whoa! What's the matter? Are you okay? Uh... What did you do? Nothing. I, I just asked him some stuff. Ventus cannot tell you anything. Because he cannot remember anything. Huh? Master, why is Benita still free? Ah, yes. Well, I did my best to contain him the moment he emerged, but... He managed to escape. Hmm. Benitas uses the Keyblade to sow seeds of darkness. And now you see the world's team with his ghastly underlings. The Unversed. He has no control over the darkness in his heart. The Keyblade is not his to bear. He's an abomination beyond hope of salvation. Lend me your strength, Terra. Right this wrong that I have wrought. But I have no idea. What where was to find that? <laughs> Did you see like how weird his face looked in that his shot? Darkness is drawn to the light which he seeks to disrupt. Zaynorts, I mean. And then destroy. It stands to reason that he will strike next in the City of Light, Radiant Garden. <laughs> Don't worry, Master. I'll take care of Vanitas. All right, and on that note, I think we're going to call it an episode. It has been, what, three worlds? Or two worlds and two kind of minor inconveniences? Um, when we next pick up the controller, we'll be headed to Radiant Garden. But between now and then, I'm going to do a little grinding, because Radiant Garden tends to be where the game ups the difficulty. So uh, when we come back, I'll be higher level. And we'll be ready to take on Radiant Garden. Until then, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, and goodbye.